State your name, please. Joseph. And your raison d'être. What? Your reason for being. Yeah, I know what it means. Just face it up here real quick. So tell me, are all your subjects as self-aware? Let's know their own raison d'être. Isn't it a little bit difficult to define yourself when you're stuck in your own head? No one else seems to have a problem with it. What is this? I'm apologizing. For what? Well, lots of things. Uh, are you Jewish? No. Okay. Are you Christian? No. Okay, this one time when I was in the third grade, there was this girl named Carly, and so she sent her two best friends over to ask if I wanted to go study with her. Mm. And I told them no, because she was the chubby girl. Uh huh. Now, I'm not saying you're fat. I'm saying guys, no, they can be shallow. I'm apologizing for my gender. Uh -huh. It's not that a shallow guy wouldn't go for you. You're attractive. I mean, your dress, it's, um,. You know what I should apologize for is the way construction workers, they must give you cat calls all the time, right? Right? Savoir faire. Huh? Savoir faire, it's, you know, to be good at social interactions. Yeah, I get it. What are you, French now? Well, I enjoy French New Wave cinema. Really? I mean, really, cinema? Have you seen Legetti? No. So you don't know? Filming a doc? Yeah, chronically. Actually, I wanted to do something for the community, and I thought the best way to do that would be to apologize for things, make myself open to people. Are you kidding? Not at all. Sarcastic? No. Um, you know what? I discovered, though, the word sarcasm comes from the phrase tearing of flesh, so I uh, want to get rid of sarcasm and irony altogether. You're serious about that hat? What am I missing exactly? Style. No, what I mean is... I know what you mean, I know what you mean. I know. I'm saying that whole style over substance thing, you know? Youthful iconoclasm thing. Like nothing feels good, everything's permitted, right? You know, debauched visceral shock slot, like the fashion industry, or like this rat is on the subway, man. I'm in the subway and this rat is like in the car. Door shut, and then this chick down at the end of the car. She screams, the rat's freaking out. She's running this way, she's over there. Finally, this Mexican dude gets up, right? Uno, dos, trace, squishissima. Brains all over the car, eyeballs rolling down. Did the... you say anything? Man, I would have had him do it in military boots if I had my camera. No, that's horrible. No. I would have given him 20 bucks he did in the red stiletto heels. No, that's horrible. Yeah. Is this a charity or something? I don't even know where to begin. Sorry. You don't care about that, Rad Joe. Don't pretend you do, man. Your tear ducts would bleed if you cried for every person that was crushed like that. So you think it's okay? I don't think anything. No, you just don't give a shit. There's not enough shits to give. 